Good evening guys, welcome back to Rara's Adventures. How are we all today? We are on vlog 40. Oh yeah. Vlog 40. Vlog 40, not 40. I oh, don't know, I'm in a really happy mood today. I'm not going to sing to you, sorry. How are you all today? I hope you're well. Look, I'm dressed today. Da -da, da -da -da -da. So, no one on yet, is there? No, I'm going to wait a minute and uh, see if anyone joins us. I hope we had a good day. Friday day, isn't it? Weekend. Mm. I've, got, I've got not a lot on tomorrow. But I'm going to go exploring on Sunday. Really looking forward to it. Cannot wait. Um, so today I had my mum over, which was a good day. We did some editing, which was fine. And I released my post today. I don't know if you've seen it yet. Um, what's the post about today? The post today was about um, bath benches so head on over hello Haley. how are you all today yeah so I did a post on the bath bench I also was very brave and phoned up the OT and explained to them that I hadn't seen them for, since I moved in here which was about five years ago and that I've had a few falls in the bathroom and I think that I need to be reassessed um, like my bathroom, home, whatever so yeah, I was really brave phoned them up I hate phoning people up I start stuttering and all sorts but um, did that and they're like yeah, okay you're still in our system um, someone's going to contact me within two weeks so watch this space I'll keep you updated but hopefully they can help with something more stable. I don't know. I don't know. I'll let you know. Um, yeah. What have you been up to today, Hayley? Friday. I love Fridays. Why do I love Fridays? Because it's the weekend. Oh, yeah. I, feel, I don't know what's going on now. I feel really tired but really bubbly all at the same time. And my ear... My left ear is drawing me. So sorry. So sorry. Don't know what happened there. Um, Hayley has put, is watching with you. What are you watching with me? I'm confused. I don't know. Unless she means she's watching with you. I don't know. Um, oh, is that what you mean? You're watching with me. <laughs> I don't know. Um yeah my ears been driving me crazy i had a cold way back when at christmas hi lizzie and um my ears started playing up then then it went off and now it's come back again it's driving me mad blooming mad and then it keeps ringing really sharply oh i don't like it don't like it so good evening that's very posh isn't it good evening Hayley Purr I'm excited about Sunday I went downtown to get my godson another birthday present he's gonna be one bless him ah oh, that's cool are you allowed to say what you got him or might the parents see that is my question um no Hi hey look, look they're having a conversation between themselves now. Rude. Joking, I'm joking. Um yeah. I don't know what I was saying. Poof. Gone. Gone. So that's cool. I'm glad you've had a good day. Are you excited about Sunday and don't give away where we're going, Hayley? Mm. I am. I'm really excited. <laughs> Um, really looking forward to it and it's meant to rain in the morning but we're not going to let that put us off 
because we're going to just carry on going and the camera's got a jacket so it's all happy days i'm really glad about that so yesterday's question was how do you do your weekly or monthly shopping etc uh we had some comments um shall put go down on my beauty scooter i said i'll go on my beauty scooter mum says she goes by car with her husband which is my dad Steve uh, because she can't carry it um, but right just thinking of that did you know right if you've got one of these which is connected to a pen one of these and you're wearing it it means you've got an di uh, invisible disability and you may need assistance if you go up to a uh, member of staff in whatever shop you're in they should come and help you assist with your shopping and um, help carry it out to your car so yeah um, Hayley put no parents might seem see Tom gets to see him on Sunday and I'm very jealous oh, I'm so sorry Hayley she's put more um it's also his sister's 50th which i can't believe as she looks about 38 again jealous ah <laughs> uh, i'm sorry Haley. you're gonna have to come with me lizzie lake has put well i had a great day meeting which was good then all afternoon in the laundrette oh laundrette and that's a good day is it what, you had to go to a laundrette? Is your washing machine broken? Is that, is that the uh, problem? Oh dear. Um, yeah. So, yeah, remember this. This is really important. And we need to help get the word out. It's really helpful. And you can go into Tesco's or Sainsbury's. They're down here supporting it now. And you can just ask for one if you don't see it. And you can say, I would like a sunflower lanyard, please. Okay, that's all you've got to say. And they'll pass one over. Or you can email them. Or you can phone them. So there's lots of different options. And if you go on my website, there's all the other options on there as well. Which are important. We need to get the word out. Because um, they're amazing. Oh... Lizzie Lake put, yep, machine broken. That's not good, is it? We had that just before Christmas. <laughs> Mind you, we did look on Facebook, and that's where we got ours from. And it was quite cheap, so have a look around. Um, they, they seem to be quite cheap to pick up these guys anyway, don't they? As a bum, though, I hate it. I'm not having a washing machine. It's like, narrow. I hate doing washing boring so boring um today's question is are you going away this year and how did you find planning for your holiday now the reason i say this is because people with physical disabilities who may be in a wheelchair or whatnot have to take in consideration more than just pack the bags and let's go they have to i do too i mean i'm not in a wheelchair but i have to think of extras um so like do i have disabled toilets is it flat ground will i be able to get into the building will i um will they f basically cater for whatever your disability is Liz has put, I'm getting one on Sunday. Ah, oh, not long then, not long. Um, so it's it's quite an important thing. Or do you go with a group that specialises for disabled people? Or do you go with family? Or, you know? So it's not just a case of, yeah, let's pack the bags and go. For example, me... I have to 
make sure there's disable shower so I need help showering I need to make sure what else do I need to make sure Ugh, sorting out medication ready to go I hate doing that one because you have to be semi organised and I never am I have to make sure I've got my walking sticks. So I have to make sure I pack double because of weak bladder and problems with bowel. So there's a lot of things considerate. Considerate? Considerate? Oh, I can't even think of the word. And like, I'm on injection, so I'm going to have to take them. Ugh, didn't even think of that. Yeah, so, yeah, lots of different things to think about. So, are you planning a holiday? And how hard or easy was it to organise? That is today's question, so let me know. Um, I'm going to Cornwall in June, and I'm really, really excited. Um, and I'm going with my parents, as well as hubby and the girls, dogs, girls, yeah. Um, so I'm really excited about that. I'm going with my sister so we can look after each other. Yes, lots of medication and bladder problems for me. Yes, it's a lot to think about, isn't it? Like you have to pet, pack extra clothes in case you have accident. And make sure you've got enough medication. And I always make sure that I've got a little bit more medication just in case there, for some unknown reason I can't get back before, you know, I always take maybe four days extra, just in case. I'd rather be over-prepared than not prepared enough. Does that make sense? I think that makes sense. Um, yes, yeah, so that's kind of how I think about it. Also, I have to make sure I've got all my pillows so I can try and get comfortable. I take a water bottle because of spasms and everything. So, yeah, it's sort of thing about... It's not just your general highly clothes and food. It's everything else on top. Really frustrating. And then it's finding places to visit whilst you're on holiday. Are they going to cater for your disabilities? Are you going to manage it? Is there going to be a lot of stairs? Is there a lift? There's so much to think about, isn't there? So much. But it's all part of it I guess and once you're there hopefully you enjoy yourselves enough sorry if you can hear thinking it's me playing with this so I'm a silly mood um yeah so yeah good question I think so it'd be interesting to see the results of that um Tigger is doing well um mum came round for a day as I said and one of her dogs called Shadow thought he would put his bum in Tigger's hat and she wasn't very impressed. No. She kind of went to lift her head but obviously where his bum was in the hat she couldn't so she was like meh, meh. Like that. It was quite funny. My impression does not do any help for it I'm afraid. Sorry. Um, yeah. But apart from that, they all got along very well. I bet she can't wait to take that hat off. Even like, um, Mum bought the more bony eh? They were what, about that big? Well, I had to break it up because she can't actually eat it because she can't use her paws, so then she gets grumpy and it's like, ugh. So I feed it to her. Bless her cotton socks. Um, <clears throat> she's been on one walk today. She'll be going out again in a minute when I've finished here. Just probably halfway around the block to see how she goes. It all depends on her, really. Um, yeah, so there you go. Tomorrow I am going to be... Oh, you know I bought this jacket for um, my camera. Yeah, I was, I was trying to put it on today. I did it, kind of. But... I just don't understand how it's going to work. So it's going to be a case of playing around with it. I'm not 100% sure how it's going to work. It will keep it dry, but I don't know if I'll be able to see anything when filming. So that's going to be a bit of trial and error, I think. I'm not sure, sure. Uh, yeah, 
so I'll be doing that tomorrow also getting the dress ready to go and uh, yeah put her around obviously walk Tigger uh, a bit boring really at the minute I know it's not Tigger's fault I just yeah yeah don't know I don't know um yeah that's it really for me guys I don't have much more to report on that I know of do I? no no I don't I don't so don't forget today's question which is are you going on holiday and how did you find with the planning and organising of the holiday let me know what's the oh face for oh have to wait because there's lag on here or something and I keep forgetting. Hope you get your washing machine sorted on Sunday. That'd be nice. And everything. Okay. So I'm going to leave it there. I can't believe we're on vlog 40. It's crazy. It's gone so quick. Good. Good. I'm not complaining at all. Okay. I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to let you guys comment on today's question. And I will catch up with you all tomorrow at 6pm to let you know what's been going on. Okay, so have a lovely day tomorrow and a lovely evening. And I will see you all tomorrow. Bye, bye.